And Ron, I know you want to break down Max Fried. Yeah. I do. You know, first, though, I, I just saw the Red Sox. You were doing a lot of uh, highlights of the Red Sox. Verdugo, Duran, Yoshida on time right yes. now. So their offense looks great. And you said it right. Sale Kluber. Give you a little more than maybe Paxton. We're place. getting back. Paxton, you're They're getting back. They're just interesting. They're playing a lot better. We were so we were quick to bury Heim Bloom's but decision making in the off season. You kind of got to let it let it play out. Yeah, be patient, right? You told me something a few years ago. You said your buddy Brian McCann said when Max Fried takes the mound, even his rookie year, it's win day. Yeah. Right? You said that to me, and I thought found that so interesting that he could make such a, a great impact so quickly. Um, I think what happens for young pitchers a lot of the times when they come through the farm system is that they learn so much about their own mechanics, they become mechanical. Yeah. And the thing about Max Reed is that he's one of the best athletes we have in the game. And I think with his hard work and his work with Rick Kranitz, he's made his delivery more, more athletic. And what has that allowed him to do is that right now, he is evolving to the kind of pitcher makes Juan Soto look like this right but he's getting to the point where when he was a fastball curveball pitcher when he first came up he is just starting to evolve into what he's going to be when I first saw him come to the major leagues I thought boy this kid is going to be the next Cole Hamill he's going to have a lot of success he's a great looking kid he's athletic he's going to be playing in the playoffs a lot just like Cole Hamill's did but I'm thinking that at some point he might have a bigger upside than Cole Hamels. That changeup, by the way, is the best pitch. I saw it against the Mets, only five innings because of the rain delay. It's the best pitch, I've, I, the best changeup I've seen him have throughout his career. But he's gotten to the point now with the curveball, with the changeup, with the fastball, that he's able to get hitters that they can't sit on one pitch. Yeah, no. Why don't we look? Why don't we? Why don't we love him more? Because we love strikeouts. And we love swing and misses, I guess. But he doesn't have that. You know what he does? Soft contact. That's what he does. He stays away from that hard contact. And you can see the evolution of his pitches. What he's eventually done, which Alcantara has done, which Luis Castillo has done. He has the ability to throw four pitches at any time for strikes. You can't sit on any of them. And he's using both sides of the plate. I thought he got glove side heavy there for a short period of time maybe a year year and a half but now he's using both sides of the plate and he's evolved into yeah. a complete pitcher. There's a couple things when I look at Max Fried obviously living in Atlanta and Alex Anthopoulos is handing out all these extensions. <laughs> they better back it up for this dude. They might have missed the window uh, because uh, they might have. Yeah but he's the one guy I think he's going to age well. I mean, Strider looks the part, don't get me wrong. He's one of the best, but he's pitching with 99 to 100. I would Ferocity. think that's very easy to, to make that happen. That's right. And be successful. This guy doesn't have to have his best stuff. Nickel and dimes and has elite weapons at times. He can go to every quadrant for me. And I think he's... I think there's more there. I think if you watch that rip, he'll arms, he'll lose pitches. I, I think he could even get tighter it's, it's, as his career goes on. I, I totally agree. I think what uh, what happens for Max, and you saw in that rip, that sometimes he gets frustrated if he doesn't throw the perfect pitch. What happens to pitchers with Max Webb? That great stuff. He throws a nasty curveball, and he wants to throw a nastier one. Yeah. That nasty curveball was where it's at. Just stay right in that rhythm. Stay right in that place. And uh, he's one of the best Yeah, guys Braves got to have him. Braves got to have him. Charlie Morton isn't going to pitch forever. That's right. Kyle Wright, dinged up. I mean, he's your, he's your horse. We're discussing the ace status. Yeah, is it, is it Spencer Strider or Max Freed for you? You're going to say Freed. I knew you would. Freed's getting the ball. Done it okay. longer. 